Diabetes is a serious widespread health concern in Kentucky, but it is the mission of Madison County Health Department to minimize that epidemic locally. We spoke to Kelly McBride, an official of the Madison County Health Department, about the details of two new classes being offered to those who are diabetic or at risk of developing diabetes. Visit the walk-in clinic at Irvin Primary Care on Friday evenings and weekends with no appointment necessary. A service of Mercy Health, Markham and Wallace Hospital. For those times when it's not serious enough to go to the ER, but you feel too sick to wait until Monday, visit Irvin Primary Care. McBride tells us that she has seen an alarming trend of increased diabetes diagnoses among Kentuckians. Half of Kentucky adults either have diabetes or pre-diabetes and many of them don't know it. We don't generally have the best lifestyle, so we, we don't get enough exercise, and I, you know, I'm, I'm chief among the sinners on that. I need to uh, exercise more myself. We need to be physically active and be aware of our poor eating habits. Education is important when it comes to living with diabetes and the health department is doing their part in teaching people all the details. We have a prevention program and then we also have an education program for those people who already know that they have diabetes or have been recently diagnosed with diabetes. So those classes are um, provided in the odd number months, so we've got some in January and March. The January dates are the 28th and the 30th, and the March dates are the 24th and 26th. It's on a Tuesday and a Thursday from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. According to McBride, the individuals who are officiating the classes are certified and will offer qualified advice on living with diabetes. To sign up for one of the educational seminars, you can call 859-228-2044. In addition to the in-person classes, the health department is offering up a new online course aiming to prevent the onset of diabetes. That program is certified by the CDC. So if you want to learn more about that program, you can go to cdc.gov and learn more about it. The, the program that launched in January, the registration is closed for that, but there's possibly another class that could start in the spring. For more stories like this, be sure to visit WBONTV.com. I'm Gage Hill.